you know, to, to grow the sport, you know, these, these communities of color aren't just going to come to it. I think we, we have to go to them and, you know, expose them to it. And, you know, representation matters in hockey because, um, you know, you know, kids coming up wanting to play the sport, they need to see you know, people that look like them, dress like them, talk like them, act like them, you know, come from the same places of them. Uh, like them, I think that's important for for them to see, so they can be exposed to the sport. Sometimes it's it's tough to go to, um, you know, it's tough to get into anything when you don't have somebody to look up to that um, you know that you can relate to. I think uh, a welcoming environment is very important. It starts kind of both ways um, with having role models uh, that you know, especially kids starting that maybe didn't think about it how, as a role model in in, in hockey and. Um, some somewhat higher up with you know any type of success and I think that helps a lot and, and I think it's you know not just the kids in hockey but also the the leaders and the you know the coaches and the team management at, at a young age to kind of create that and um, wanting to to get that to that point I think inclusiveness is a big one making everyone feel welcome giving people the opportunity to to watch hockey play hockey uh, just experience hockey in general be around players, be around other fans, it's a, another sense of community. But I think the biggest thing is, is just an opportunity and making sure when people do get that opportunity, we as a hockey family are, are inclusive and welcoming.